Oh, Trash Brother? Why would you call him that? That's what he's publicly known as since he's not talented in the field of cultivation. Even though I want to stand up for him, there's not much I can do in the end. What a poor child. But with a beautiful and kind sister like yourself, he's quite lucky in that aspect. Not at all. Shaotian is actually a thoughtful child. Recently, he's been treating cultivating seriously. Oh, just recently. A trash youth's personality changes within a night. Is it a case of being reborn or taken over by a more powerful being? Yes. After being stuck at the same level, he finally made a breakthrough. He also demonstrated extraordinary talent in the field of medicinal elixir and arrays. He even pointed out an elder's mistake once. His change shows that your persuasion was effective. He understands where you're coming from as his sister. You may have been harsh to him in the past, but that's from your genuine concern for him. Isn't that right? Is the young master consoling me? I didn't expect him to understand me so well. Usually, not even Shaotian understands me. He just thinks I'm excessively harsh to him. It's naturally a good thing that little brother Lin Tian is turning over a new leaf. I'm sure he was just a diamond in the rough. Since he did point out an elder's mistake. This talent. How can he be a diamond in the rough? With his talent, he couldn't even break into the spirit sea realm before. He couldn't even break through to the spirit sea realm? Then how is he practicing alchemy? Perhaps the Lin family has an ancient lost art they passed on to him. That. Kiki. It looks like Lin Chiohan is beginning to doubt Lin Tian's change. Harvesting this new faded one's luck seems to be a lot easier than I had expected. Rules for clearing a faded one's luck value for drops. The system may drop an additional heavenly reward for killing a faded one whose luck value has been cleared to zero. Heavenly reward? Interesting. I can't touch Yi Chin yet because he's my treasurer seeker rat. It looks like I'll need to speed up my first harvest of Lin Tian. Young master, I made some spiritual pastries, hoping that it may satisfy your hunger at night. You troubled yourself with bringing food at such a late hour, Lady Lin. On behalf of the young master, Qingda thanks you. Young master Gu. Then, I'll have to trouble Saintess Qingda with such. I will now leave to not disturb the young master's rest. Just one meeting was enough for Lady Lin to fall for young master. What? Are you jealous? Young master is sophisticated. I know it'll be difficult to gain your favor, so whether I get jealous is not important. If young master is interested, you may certainly have Lady Lin stay by your side. Woman, when did you start saying things you don't actually mean? Older sister. Shao Tian, what are you doing here? Where did you go at such a late hour? Did you perhaps go visit young Master Gu? Keep your nose out of my business and focus on cultivating. Lin Chiohan, that Gu is not a good person. Don't be deceived by his looks. What nonsense are you spouting? Young Master Gu is modest and well-mannered. How can someone as gentle as him be a bad person? On the other hand, I'll be content if you can be even 1% as outstanding as young Master Gu. How can you be so foolish to not even be able to tell? You've been acting strange lately. Even if young Master Gu is a bad person with his standing, what could he want from me? You should reflect on your behavior. You? Lin on this brat. While his cultivation did increase, his temper has also gotten quite big. I forgot to ask him just now, but how did he learn alchemy? Before, he wouldn't budge when I told him to practice. But now, I rarely see him around. Could a master be giving him advice? Or is it that? Lin Johan has begun to doubt Lin Tian's personality change. Lin Tian's luck value has decreased by 50 and the host's fate value has increased by 250. As expected, 
everything is progressing in the direction I had planned. I reckon Lin Tian will soon lose his patience and make his move on me. I initially wanted to deal with you after getting close to that woman named Su Chinga, but you just had to step between Lin Chiohan and this body's original owner. The infatuation stemming from this body disturbs my focus. Since you want to die so badly, I'll help you out. Using a 99 enticing incense soaked in the blood essence of eight poisonous things, wax made from the bones of three different ferocious beasts, and this body's 15 years of life. I borrow heaven and earth's power to seize one's life and destroy their genuine soul. Outer City Heavenly Demon Curse Initiate Haha, -ha, I knew it would be too much for this current body to use a curse of such grade. But with the addition of this body's 15 years of life, even if Gu Chungda somehow avoids death, he'll definitely end up being crippled. This is what happens when you touch what's mine. This is pretty much what I had expected. What a familiar heavenly demon aura, so it s the outer city heavenly demon curse, huh? With your current ability, I wonder to what extent will the curse work? To use a diabolic technique on me is rather arrogant of you. This, young master, this aura, it's coming from the Lin family. Is it the Lin family's ancestor? To think it would rebound on me. Who would V thought a demonic curse of this grade would actually strengthen my primordial spirit? There was even lifespan added to the curse. Lin Tian's lifespan has drastically decreased. His luck value has decreased by 150, and the host's fate value has increased by 750. I haven't even done anything to you, yet you've already given me such a great gift. You played yourself, Faded One. You've done yourself a disservice. This old servant has failed to protect his master. Please punish me. What are all of you doing? Our governance is lacking. Please forgive you, S, young master. Are you okay, young master? It's fine. A curse of this level can't harm me. But I'd like to know who in the lower realm is capable of using such means. If the curse is broken, the person who initiated it will definitely experience a rebound. Yes, that's right. This lowly one will immediately gather all forces to find the culprit and provide the young master with a resulty. Oh, Lin Tian. The current you probably can't even compare to an ordinary person. Come out, shout Tian. Something serious happened tonight, so the family head has summoned everyone together for a meeting. What should I do? Even my natal source was damaged, so I can't walk properly now. If someone discovers me in this state, I'm afraid everyone will know that I was the one who attacked that man. Is this really the end for me, the mighty heaven destroyer divine king? Shout Tion. Open the door. If you don't respond, I'm just going to come in. Oh right, I can pretend to be dead. I've already taken over the original Lin Tion's body. If I stop this body's pulse, it'll naturally be lifeless. Cultivators below the realm of Divine King definitely won't notice. As long as I get through this, I can just use a Divine Soul secret art to revive myself later. Then, I'll be able to hide without anyone knowing. Gu Chungda, we will settle this debt another time. Lin Tian Young master, I failed to discipline my descendants properly. Please punish me. You found the perpetrator? 
Yes, we found the perpetrator, but... Oh, what is it? Yes, it's a child of the clan named Lin Tion. He's a junior who many usually are not fond of. But when we found him, his meridians were injured, and he was lying in a pool of blood without breath. He's dead? This lowly one failed to discipline him properly. Please punish me, Lord. The matter of Lin Tian attempting to murder the young master has brought pisgrace upon the family. We also ask to be punished. At the very least, he's still a fated one. You're telling me he killed himself before killing me, the villain? What a failure. But since the system hasn't displayed anything, it means that Lin Tian is definitely still alive. The list of fated ones, Yi Chen, Lin Tian. Could he be playing dead? But with your weakened remnant soul, you won't even be able to withstand the winds of the mortal world. Where could you have escaped to? This damn Lin Tian. He's unable to achieve anything but is skilled at ruining things. It's fine if we lose that useless life of his, but if the Lord decides to place blame, our entire family will be shouldering that burden. I thought Shao Tian had changed. But why has he suddenly committed such a selfish evil act? Oh, Lin Tian, you're going to bring the Lin family to ruin. So this is the taste of power. Even though Gu Chunga hasn't done anything, everyone in the Lin family is trembling in fear and complaining about Lin Tian. Lin Tian has been rejected by the entire family. His luck value has decreased by 100, and the host's fate value has increased by 500. Oh, Lin Tian's series of actions increased my fate value by so much. I guess it's fine, since he's not worth much value anymore. The last straw is probably his bond with Lin Chiohan. Please punish this old servant of yours, young master. As my descendant, Lin Tian's actions have gravely disrespected you. I feel too ashamed to face you. This event is certainly strange. I've heard Lady Chiohan speak of Lin Tian's matters before. I do think it's unlikely for an ordinary kid like him to attempt something like killing me. When I was in the upper realm, IT was not uncommon for people to use secret arts to seize another's divine spirit to control their body. Although Lin Tian may have done it, I don't think it has anything to do with the Lin family. I'm not one to be unreasonable and place blame on those unrelated to the matter. I will let this matter pass on behalf of Elder Ming's long service. Thank you for your kindness, Lord. The Lord is truly reasonable and magnanimous. Thank you, young master. I will definitely investigate this matter and provide you with an explanation. All right. In that case, you may all leave now. And make sure not to cremate Lin Tian's corpse. Yes, my Lord. After all, I haven't finished harvesting him. I'm still waiting for him to revive. Lady Chiohan. With nothing to do, my days have been dull. Why don't you take me on a stroll in the city in the next few days? Yes, young master. If you'd like to, there's no way I would dare to decline. The system previously displayed that I would also receive fate points if I reel in women connected to the fated one. Her luck value is 200. It shouldn't be hard to turn Lin Chiohan's heart towards me with a few methods. I wonder if her luck value would steadily increase, thus increasing mine, like Su Chinga. Or is that a characteristic specific to her? Anyhow, I should have Lin Chiohan stay close to me for some time. Three days later, what's happening lately? Why are the powerhouses of the eight cities all rushing to Zhongzhou? You haven't heard? The Lin family's ancestor brought back a mysterious lord. I heard he came from the upper realm's immortal sect. Anyone who establishes a connection with him would surely achieve great success. Even the Zhongzhou Younger Generations Conference location has been changed to the ancient Chengyue city. Exactly. I heard that many powerhouses in the ancient sacred mountains, 
who have stayed hidden for a long time, even came to see this Lord. It's been some time since we last met, and Brother Jean Yang's cultivation seems to have increased a lot. Ha ha, it's not worth mentioning. But I heard that Brother Tsung Tian recently grasped a sacred Lord art. I was just lucky. IT can't compare to my fellow brother's achievements. Brother Jean Yang, I heard you fought against a talented person from Dong Wang, and were unable to determine the winner even after exchanging countless blows, and somehow ended up becoming brothers? Yeah. Let me tell you. My brother's talent is definitely seen once in a thousand years. Even though he was only in the intermediate lord realm, he was able to exchange over a hundred blows with me and not fall behind. He even pushed me to show my great son physique before finally subduing him. A saint of Jiao sacred land Jin Yang. Such a person exists in the world? Sigh, that brother of mine is sophisticated, and his talent is extraordinary. You can tell with one glance that he's destined to accomplish something great. It's a shame that he offended an important person and was framed. In the end, he had no choice but to flee to Zhongzhou. Don't tell me you're talking about that person who caused an uproar. I heard he sought after someone he didn't deserve and got jealous of a certain man. Bullshit. It was clearly that woman who wanted to raise her influence by relying on that man and betrayed my brother. She even spread all those lies. GSP no way, right? It's likely that it's true. Brother Jean Yang is not one to tell lies. May I ask who the surname of this new brother you made? If I ever meet him one day, I'd like to befriend him. Yeah. That. Look. That's. To be personally received by the Lin family elder in the profound realm. Is that the Lin family's prized daughter, Lin Chiohan? Despite her young age, I heard she's already an elder at the Taoist Academy. The extraordinary woman in turquoise seems to be the Donghuang Sacred Lands Taishuan Saintess. That must mean the man in white is that person. To think we would be able to meet that man. This is a once-in-a-lifetime chance. I must greet him. Damn it. To think we would bump into him here. Whoa. This dome oversees the common people, but only I can hold the nine heavens in my hands. The person who built this pavilion sure knows how to enjoy life. Only I can hold the nine heavens in my hands? How do you view cultivation, young master? The so-called cultivation is simply a struggle of the mortal world, using the flesh as a raft to cross, through the thorn of waves in the sea known as the mortal world, to the other side. The flesh is a raft, and the sea known as the mortal world. The young master's understanding is sophisticated and quite different from others. With merely two sentences, it's as if I've come to understand Tao. I suppose cultivating in the upper realm is much more mysterious and extensive than I can ever imagine. Would you like to go there? Young master. Chiu Han. Does not dare to. I know that what Lin Tian has done to the young master is definitely unforgivable. Even though the young master already warned me that day. There's no need to blame yourself. What I said that day was simply a casual remark. I didn't expect things to unfold this way either. But if Lady Lin still feels guilty, there's actually something I can entrust you to do. Please speak, young master. Please watch over your brother's body. Judging by his behavior so far, I don't think it's a matter as simple as being controlled. I'm afraid an unknown existence has forcibly occupied his body. Since such secret arts are not uncommon in the upper realm, Reviving the body afterward isn't impossible either. Reviving from death? Do such secret arts really exist? When I discovered Lin Tian, his heart pulse was clearly damaged, and he had no signs of life. If it really is as the young master had said, could Lin Tian be faking his death? It's only speculation of mine. Lady Lin just needs to pay more attention. If Lin Chiohan sees Lin Tian come back alive, 
then that bond between the two of them should break. Once that last bond breaks, Lin Tian will have hardly any luck value left. So there won't be necessary to keep him alive. Lord, there are a few young disciples from the eight cities who would like to greet you. Oh, since they're already here, you may let them come up. Chu Xian greets the young master. We greet the young master. There's no need to be polite. I am the Bayou of Saint Yu. I've wanted to meet you for a long time. As expected, the Lord is exceptionally refined, just as the rumors have said. We're extremely honored to have been graced with your visit to the great land of Zhongzhou. These sons of heavens, who are usually arrogant, actually have such a pleasing side to them. Even these powerful saintesses and princesses lower their pride to gain the young master's favor. Do such beauties not affect him at all? Speaking of that, the way the young master treats me is completely different than how he's treating them. Even though he's powerful and extraordinary, He's understanding and gentle to me. Young Master Gu treats me really well. A luck event has been triggered. You've successfully captured Lin Chiohan. The host's luck value has increased by 200, and your fate value has increased by 1000. You didn't disappoint me. Character Gu Chunga. Identity Personal disciple of the Taoist Immortal Palace Physique and Bloodline. Demonic Core and Datus Bones Cultivation, Midlord Realm Techniques, Datus Immortal Manual, 7th Level, Incarnation of 10,000 Demons, Talent, Innate Divine Recitation, Talent, Immortal Devouring Demonic Art, Fate Value, 2600 Luck Value, 350 System Shock, Accessible Storage, Destructive City Incantation 1, Broken one third piece of world seed one. Since I've captured both Su Qingda and Lin Chiohan, my luck value is now more than 300. My cultivation is among the top in the lower realm, so I can save my fate value for when I need it. But I could try training Lin Chiohan, since I sensed a bit of alchemy talent from her when she came to give me pastries. System Shop Supporting Items Novice Alchemy Manual Fate Value 100 I'll find a chance to give her this Novice Alchemy Manual. How she progresses from then will depend on her talent. A Fated One's Bond has been detected. A random mission has been triggered. Mission Content Suppress the Fated One's Brother Mission Reward 500 Fate Value Failure Punishment Not a random mission? Lintion is already done for. So this mission is triggered by Yi Chen? As a fated one, it's reasonable for him to have made a connection with one or two sons of heavens during his escape. Since this is a random mission, it looks like the target is within this crowd of people. Chu Xian, what instructions do you have for me, young master? Have you heard any news of Yi Chen in Zhongzhou? Yi Chen? Young master. About that? So you mean to say no? That? Yi Chen? Who's that? Judging by the Lord's expression, he seems slightly upset. Yi Chen. Why do I feel like I've heard that name somewhere? The great land of Donghuang. My lord, I heard that Jialo Sacred Land's Jin Yang Saint recently met a talented person from Dong Huang. Is he perhaps the Yi Chen you're looking for? Shit! This damn Bayou is Saint. Oh! I wonder who Jin Yang Saint is acquainted with. What is his name? Isn't that Saint Jin Yang? Why would he be acquainted with Yi Chen? Since Saint Jin Yang isn't speaking, does that mean the person you know is the one I'm looking for? My lord, I wonder if the person you're looking for. Answer my question with yes or no. To think this young lord's strength is this terrifying. I've never felt pressure of this magnitude from even a sacred or imperial lord. Damn it. 
I was in such a hurry to gain his favor that it might actually backfire now if Jin Yong implicates me. My lord, I indeed have a sworn brother by the name of Yi Chen. Where is he now? I am sorry, my lord. I can't give his location away. Are you out of your mind, Jin Yong? My lord, Jin Yong must have been brainwashed by Yi Chen. Normally, he would never do such a foolish thing. Shut up. Yi Chen is my sworn brother. I know his character well. Rather, is there perhaps a misunderstanding between my lord and sworn brother? It's your honor to be questioned by me. Whether it was a misunderstanding or not, how are you qualified to question me back? Age Saint the saint was foolish and unintentionally offended my lord. Please forgive him. Elder Ming, this old servant is here. He's the Lin family's ancestor who ascended 30,000 years ago. To think he would refer to himself as a servant before this lord. After tomorrow, I don't wish to hear anything of Jolo's sacred land's existence. This old servant understands. Senior, wait. It's over. Everything is over. With just an effortless remark, he settled an entire powerhouse's fate. Indifferent and superior, handling everything like a god. Is this how the young master truly is? Random mission has been completed with a perfect rating. An additional 40% fate value has been rewarded. The final reward is a fate value of 700. Gyolu Sacred Land Sacred Lord this, who has the Gyolu Sacred Land offended to have brought upon such a calamity. The heavens wills the destruction of the Gyolu Sacred Land. Brother Jean Yang. Sigh, in the end, things proceeded in the way I least wanted to see. I will definitely kill Gu Chengda. I will. Xiaochen. Master, no need to speak further if you intend to persuade me to let go of my resentment. The ancient heavenly hidden region will soon unveil itself. I must inherit the hidden region's master's legacy and obtain the demonic weapon that has been sealed for ages. Lady Chiohan, how come you've been talking less ever since we returned from the Jiaxing Pavilion? Did I frighten you? Just a little bit. It may have been because I've never seen that side of young master. However, the young master does treat me well. I was careless. As a token of apology, take this novice alchemy manual. Thank you, young master. This was exactly what I needed. Young master, you also frightened me. Oh, tonight's moonlight is quite nice. You... Three days later. Since the Lord didn't take things to heart, we won't bother you further with our stay. From now on, we'll have to rely more on family head Lin to put in some good words for U.S. No worries. The Lin family has always enjoyed forming good relations. I will certainly remember to do that for you all. The young master is cold to others, but in a way, he has helped the Lin family maintain our reputation. Recalling the young master's response when others offended him, it's probably just as he had said that Lin Tian is no longer the Lin Tian I know. Or else, how could he have forgiven the Lin family when such a grave offense was committed against him? That poor child Lin Tian. Ah, H. H. He returned from the dead? My lady, Lin Tian he. What's with this fuss? How unsightly of you. You may leave now. To think the body would still be in such a complete state. I pulled through this one. Now, if I pretend to have lost my memory, IT shouldn't be hard to trick them. Goo, I will slowly settle things with you.
Sister, why am I here? I clearly remember being in class, why? This guy is acting as kind of dramatic. Who's the man next to you? How come I've never seen him before? Enough. What's the use in pretending now? Sister, what are you saying? I don't get it. What happened? Why am I here? Sister, what happened to you? I'm your younger brother, Lin Tian. Why don't you believe me? Do you remember when you used to complain to me when you got yelled at by the family head? And also when? Shut up. Sister, don't call me that. Who are you? Where did you hide Shao Tian? Sister, no, not me. This damn infatuation. Just had to cause trouble now. Shao Tian? Lin Chiohan, I never thought about harming you. So why must you harm me with Gu? No. Sister, it's Shao Tian's fault. Shut up. Don't think a mere trace of infatuation like you can affect me, the Heaven Destroyer Divine King. Sister. Kill me. Lin Tian has experienced backlash from the original owner's infatuation and lost control of the body. His luck value has decreased by 200, the host's fate value has increased by 1000. The fated one's luck value has been cleared to zero, triggering the kill drop rule. Shao Tian? Sai. I know you can't bear to do it yourself. You may go out first. Allow me, the bad guy, to do this. Lin Chiohan and Lin Tian are blood-related siblings. Do you know why she hasn't buried the body yet? You? You knew I was faking my death? Goo, who the hell are you? What's your motive? Motive? What motive can I have? Weren't you the one who wanted to kill me all along? So why are you asking me that now? Demonic Chi, who are you? How could you use such methods? A dead person doesn't need to know. No, no. Age, the remnant soul of a master in the divine king realm. As expected, the taste is not bad. It strengthened my primordial spirit this time too. But demonic art of this degree is not accepted here. Before I'm confident with it, I must be careful not to expose it. You completed your first kill of a faded one. Since the faded one's luck value has been cleared to zero, the kill drop rule has been triggered. Calculation in process. Congratulations on earning an additional reward from the heavens. Your luck value will be increased by 100 and your fate value by 500. You've received the first kill chest. The luck value exchange system has been activated. The host's luck value can be exchanged for fate value, the rate being one luck point for 10 fate points. I see. Since ancient times, there's been the saying to exhaust one's luck to ensure safe travels. This exchange service has, in a way, added another trick up my sleeve. Now then, you've accepted the first kill chest. You've opened the first kill chest. Congratulations on receiving Fortune Plundering Card 3. Congratulations on receiving a broken one-third piece of World Seed 1. Congratulations on receiving a System Calculation Multiplier Card 1. Fortune Plundering Card 3. Broken one-third piece of World Seed 1. System Calculation Multiplier Card 1. Fortune Plundering Card. System Calculation Multiplier Card. Fortune Plundering Card Description. Using this card will steal a faded one's luck value. There's a chance of failure determined by the faded one's current state. If the stealing succeeds, the faded one's luck value will be cleared to zero, 
and the host will earn the corresponding amount of luck value. System Calculation Multiplier Card Description When the system calculates rewards, using this card will trigger a random multiplier. The rewards may increase by 0.1 times, 10 times, or perhaps even 100 times. I can use the System Calculation Multiplier card after killing each in. As for the Fortune Plundering card, to think it could override the system's rules and directly steal a faded one's luck value. This is a great rare item. It costs 10,000 fate points in the system shop, so I must get at least 2,000 luck points back to break even when I use it. Supporting items. Fortune plundering card fate value, 10,000. This tells me that in the system's latent settings, the faded ones I'll encounter in the future will all probably possess high luck values. Heh <laughs> heh, learning this in advance isn't considered cheating, right? Additional chests from the heavens open. Congratulations on receiving the faded one's halo. It is being automatically converted. Congratulations on receiving the villain's halo. Congratulations on receiving the heart of the divine king. Ignore the difference in luck value although that does make things easier the next time I encounter a faded one. I will lose chances to increase my fate value if I directly kill the faded ones. There are both pros and cons to this, so I should remain vigilant. This heart of the Divine King contains thousands of years of cultivation by someone in the Divine King realm. I'll fuse it now. Incarnation of 10,000 Demons, Talent, Immortal Devouring Demonic Art. Fate Value, 3,000 Luck Value, 450 System Shop, Accessible Destructive City Storage, Incantation 1. Character, Gu Chunga. Halo, Fated Villain Identity, Personal Disciple of the Daoist Immortal Palace Physique and Bloodline, Demonic Core and Daoist Bones Cultivation, Late Conferred Lord Realm Techniques, Daoist Immortal Manual, 8th Level, Incarnation of 10,000 Demons, Talent, Innate Divine Recitation, Talent, Immortal Devouring Demonic Art, Fate Value, 1500 Luck Value, 450 System Shop, Accessible Storage, Destructive City Incantation, Broken 13 Piece of World Seed 2, Fortune Plundering Card 3, System Calculation Multiplier Card 1 Upgrading the Daoist Immortal Manual by one level used up 3,000 fate points, and I only ascended to the late Conferred Lord Realm. If I want to reach the peak of the Conferred Lord Realm, I'm afraid I'll have to use at least 5,000 fate points. I really can't stop harvesting the faded ones, even for a moment. The Eight Desolate Demon Halberd is appearing soon. When the time comes, I'll finish each and off, since he's worthless to me now. I should also make preparations for the upper realm. Young master. It's fine now. Everything's over. I've also eliminated the remnant soul that occupied Lin Tian's body. Lay him to rest. His body wasn't occupied for very long so his soul probably hasn't dissipated yet. He might still be able to enter the cycle of reincarnation. Yes, thank you, young master. Ancient Chongyua City, three days away from the Zhongzhou Heavenly Geniuses Conference. I didn't expect Jalo's sacred land to be annihilated like that. What is the background of that young lord from the upper realm? It's hard to tell. We of the ancient sacred mountain have stayed hidden from the world for many years. How would we know a person of that grade? IT doesn't matter what his origin is. As long as he bothers brother Yi Chen, I'll definitely make him pay the consequences. Exactly. If he dares to offend Lady Liu Li, we won't let him get away with it. Don't worry, Lady Liu Li. Even if he had persons from the upper realm, He's not a formidable opponent for U.S. from the ancient sacred mountain. He's merely a young man from the upper realm with an old servant. How the Tianqing world operates is not up to him. 
Anshwe, have you heard any news of Brother Chin? My lady, since sensing his spiritual energy within Zhongzhou last time, I haven't detected his presence since then. Is that so? Brother Chin must have greatly suffered during this time. My lady, you're a phoenix destined to soar through the nine heavens. Eventually, you'll have to return to the upper realm. And I'm afraid Yi Chin will never even reach the Emperor and God realm. I advise you to. I know you all look down on Brother Chin, but I know he'll soar to the skies. He said before not to look down on young people because our potential is limitless. It's true to put it that way, but with Yi Chin's ability, what will giving him 30,000 years even do? Some people are born at a destination others will never reach in their entire lives. Enough, Aunt Shui. I want to meet the young man from the so-called upper realm. If things become unpleasant, I'll have to ask you to deal with that old servant of his in the Empyrean God realm. Sigh. Don't worry, my lady. I won't allow anyone to hurt you. As expected, Lady Chohan's talent is extraordinary. It has only been a few days, but you've already improved so much. It was all thanks to the manual young master gifted me. I'm extremely thankful. This is. Who dares to trespass the ancient Lin's land? Ha 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 ha, insignificant Lin family. We're from the ancient sacred mountain. Quickly come and pay your respects. Ancient sacred mountain? For what matters did all of you come today? Tell Gu Chungda that Yi Chen's cousin, Yi Liuli, wishes to see him. If you truly wish to meet young Master Gu, then please wait a moment. I will tell him now. Meet? What family Hadlin said is an overstatement. Do you know what happens if you offend Lady Liuli? Do you think the Lin family still deserves to exist in the Tianqing world? Young master, let them come in. Young master, young master. At the very least, we're still people from the ancient sacred mountain. How can he kill one of you us just like that? From that strike, I faintly sense the strength of a conferred king realm. Just what is this person's background? Let's enter. Since entering the Lin family, my movements have definitely been restricted by a powerful presence. Even though I'm in the heavenly god realm, he could use his presence to restrict me while preventing me from tracing his location easily. I'm afraid that this Lin family's ancestor's ability is already, if not nearly, in the divine king realm. And the trifling presence of a conferred king realm must have been from that young man. A person of this power with a servant from the divine king realm. Wait, if this young man's surname is Gu, is he perhaps from that family? If so, I definitely can't allow my lady to offend a person of this caliber. On the other hand, it'll be better than anything if we can use this opportunity to get closer to this young master. And Shui, why did you? Don't worry, my lady. I believe that this matter is most likely a misunderstanding. Yi Chen's cousin? An ancient bloodline, entrusted to the lower realm, and a deep bond. Ha ha, it's the usual cliché trope. Do you plan on killing them? Do I seem like the type of person to randomly kill people? Let's go! Since they're so eager to send their regards, we should also take some initiative. We greet the Lord. We greet the Lord. This is exactly how a supreme young man from the upper realm should look. Your young master, Gu? Your Yi Chen's cousin? TSK, TSK. 
Aside from everything else, this Yi Chen's quite a lady killer. To think this chick has a luck value of 800. Greetings, young Master Gu. This is my lady, Yilioli. I'm the visiting elder responsible for protecting the lady in the lower realm. The lady and her servants may have offended you. I hope a magnanimous lord like you won't take it to heart. And Shui, you're overdoing it. My lady, this may really be a misunderstanding. Why don't we take this chance to talk it out? IT won't be good if a conflict arises among our own people. You're too modest, senior. What's your purpose for coming here today? Before this, may I ask if young Master Gu is from the Great Gu family? My lady is from the ancient immortal clan, the Yi family. The two families could be considered old acquaintances. The Great Gu family? Why is this only being brought up now? We can't afford to offend an ancient immortal clan, but the same goes for a great noble family. So it was the ancient immortal clan. No wonder why Lady Yi intruded without fear. Indeed, in the earlier days, my father's dealings with the Yi family were not few. It certainly seems like you've heard of U.S. Father? Could his father be the great Gu family's only successor? If that's the case, this young master's future. To think he would be the great Gu family's young master. This Gu family. Then, our young master, you die for naught. Before, we were disrespectful. We hope the Lord can forgive us. We offended you greatly as our ignorance caused us not to recognize you. Please forgive our mistake. Why is this happening? My lady, this matter is a complete misunderstanding. I believe you should apologize to young Master Gu, a person of young Master Gu's caliber. Why would he care about someone as lowly as Yi Chin? There's no need to speak further, Aunt Shui. There's no way I'm going to apologize. It was him who caused Brother Yi Chin to become like a bereaved dog escaping around and becoming the world's laughing stock. This chick is quite loyal to Yi Chen, huh? She's not budging even before such pressure. But in the end, she's just a simple-minded girl. You're close to Yi Chen? Then I'll start drilling from there. I'll slowly wear you away. So what's the purpose of your visit? If you don't provide an acceptable explanation, even if you're the ancient immortal family's descendant, I'll kill you regardless. Please calm your anger, young Master Gu. Today's matter was my lady's offense. Please show mercy, young Master Gu. You're not gonna say it? Elder Ming, this old servant is here. Kill one person every ten breaths. If anyone resists, annihilate their entire clan. Spare U.S., Your Excellency. Your Excellency. Save U.S., my lady. We don't want to die. Our entire clan's fate lies in my lady's hands. You're despicable. My lady. The tea is ready, young master. M. Why are you not understanding this, my lady? If someone of young master Gu's status really wished to kill Yi Chen, then there's no way Yi Chen could have escaped regardless of his talent. You're the ancient immortal clan's princess, and he's the great Gu family's young master. If you back down a little, I'm sure young master Gu wouldn't make things difficult for you. It's impossible for a person like him to be good. Ten breaths of time have passed. Kill. You, my lady, save me. I don't want to die yet. We came because of you. You can't just abandon U.S. like this. If your attitude is better, you can save all of U.S. from death. But why aren't you willing? Aren't our lives determined by one word of yours? Yeah, my lady. 
Can you really bear to sacrifice all of you, S, just for that brother Yichin of yours? Enough. I, Lioli, offended you with today's matter. Apologize. And hope. The young master can be understanding. Place. There's no need for an apology. Since I'm not a bad person, I obviously won't take these small matters to heart. All right, my lady. We finally resolved the misunderstanding. I knew young Master Gu wouldn't make things difficult for you. Thank you for sparing us. Thank you for being merciful. No need to thank me, since the one who allowed you to live was Lady Helioli. If you must thank someone, thank her. This guy. Young Master Gu, I came today because I had questions about a matter. I also wanted to carry out justice. Oh, carry out justice? I don't believe I've ever harassed Lady Yi. This matter relates to my brother Yi Chen. Yi Chen? I don't remember doing anything to him. Did you perhaps make a mistake? Or does Lady Yi believe I need to treat him a certain way? To me, crushing an ant isn't difficult at all. That, logically, IT wouldn't be hard for Gu Chumda to kill Brother Chen. How could Brother Chen survive after offending him? Did Brother Chen really do something wrong then? Or, as I heard from the rumors, is it because of this woman? Su Qingda has a voluptuous body and a beautiful face. It does seem reasonable for men to do crazy things for her. No, that's impossible. Brother Chen is an honest man. He would never do something as lowly as that. He <laughs> he, I didn't kill Yi Chen because he's still useful. You'll never figure out why, even if you used all of your brain cells. If young Master Gu didn't think about killing Brother Chen, then why did you erase Jello's sacred land, which had ties to him? Amusing. Did Lady Yi come today to condemn me? Are you telling me I need your permission? To kill a mere ant? That wasn't my intention. Gu Chongda is right. With his status, the matter of Jialo's sacred land was simply crushing an ant. Since it was just a mere ant, what reason would he need? The same applies to if he wanted to kill Brother Chen. If he wished for it, there's no way Brother Chen would have lived. Now, IT seems like I was deliberating trying to cause trouble. Yi Lioli's perspective of Yi Chen has wavered. Yi Chen's luck value has decreased by 100, and the host's fate value has increased by 500. Looks like I've successfully planted the thorn. Things will be easier going forward. If there aren't any other matters, you all may leave. Let's go, Aunt Shui. Young Master Gu, I think there could be more conversation between the young ones. Since you're both from the upper realm, an encounter in the lower realm could be considered serendipity. That's not necessary. I'm not interested in little girls. Gu, what are you trying to say? My lady. Character, Gu Chongda Halo, Fated Villain Identity, Disciple of the Taoist Immortal Palace Physique and Bloodline, Demonic Core and Taoist Bones Cultivation, Late Conferred Lord Realm Techniques, Taoist Immortal Manual, 8th Level, Incarnation of 10,000 Demons, Talent, Innate Divine Recitation, Talent, Immortal Devouring Demonic Art, Fate Value, 2,000 Luck Value, 450 System Shop, Accessible Storage, Destructive City Incantation, Broken Piece of Word Seed Asterisk 2, Fortune Plunder Card Asterisk 3, System Calculation Multiplier Card Asterisk 1. Now that Yululi has left the mountain, logically speaking, she will definitely take this opportunity to meet up with Yi Chen. The Secret Realm is about to open. If Yi Chen isn't dumb, he will definitely stick closely to Yululi. Center of Sky Frontier. Based on his previous actions, 
I can accurately feel the exact location he is gonna appear. By then it will be the time to get on the move. Yi Chen, you better not disappoint me. Seems like what's recorded in the map is correct. The Origin Ancient Realm is here. Now that the key to the Origin Ancient Realm is in our hands, even if there are many dangerous traps that lie within it, I can still easily reach to its core. Once I obtain the inheritance that lies within the Origin Ancient Realm, I will definitely get back at Gu Qingda and pay back all the humiliation he has done to me. And also that bitch Su Qingda. Must it really go this way? Master, you said that Gu Chengde came down to the mortal world with an old servant who could easily destroy the Jiao Holy Land. Could their purpose also be finding and opening this ancient secret realm of Tian Yuan? What you said could be correct. Besides this ancient secret realm, I don't think there is anything else within the lower realm that could interest him. Once this realm is activated, he will definitely be the first to rush here and there are many limitations that are set within this realm. Once that old servant enters, he won't be in his peak condition. At that point, all I need to do is to give him a warm greeting after obtaining the inheritance that lies within the realm's core. And by using the key to control the traps and mechanism within it, I can then rise as he falls. Master, do you think that I can accomplish my revenge? Huh? It does sound like a perfect plan, but how would you know if Gu Changa has the map, or if he has any other tricks up his sleeves in order to enter the core of the secret realm? Is that so? What Master says does make sense. What does she mean when she said that he might have tricks up his sleeves? Why is Master so confident in Gu Changa, but not in my plans? Since the last time when Gu Changa gave Master the pill, Master Shi. Also, Xiao Chun, there is something you need to pay attention to. Your cousin's sister also has a terrifying force that is backing her. It's best to not mess with them before you reach the conferred Lord Realm. Thanks for worrying about me, Master, but you don't have to worry about it. Worrying about me? Hmph. <laughs> I bet she is afraid that I will work together with Liu Li in order to deal with Gu Chengda, my master. Once Gu Chengda dies in my hands, I wonder how you will react. Let's go! A secret realm has appeared. This aura, IT seems, that this secret realm is left behind by an expert known as Ziyuan, who cares about its backstory. Such an opportunity can't be missed. I heard that the expert sacrificed his life in order to seal a fierce demon. I wonder what lies within this secret realm. Ugh, this is? My cultivation has been suppressed. Master, IT seems that the origin ancient realm limits one's cultivation to the almighty realm and below. The inheritance from expert Zun, the good thing about it is that it limits one's cultivation upon entering it. It seems like it is just as I have predicted, this origin ancient realm is made specifically for Yi Chen. If I am not wrong, Yi Chen's cultivation probably hasn't reached the late all my realm. Now that the time is ripe, it's time to harvest it. Let's move. Look, that is the Sham Guling family. It's that young master. Quickly move aside, don't block his way. Suppress your cultivations, time for us to enter. Brother Chen. Leoli, you are finally here. It's only been three years since we've met. Leoli has grown so much prettier that Su Qingda can't even be compared to her. Shut those dog eyes of yours. You are just an ant, 
a measly descendant of a servant. Do you even have the qualification to look at our young miss? One's fate cannot be foretold. The senior's word seems to be a bit too offensive. With your qualifications? An insect that hasn't even seen a real dragon of the nine skies? Only someone like Prince Ku is suitable for the young lady of our great Yi family. And Shui stopped spouting nonsense. My lady, what I said is the truth. If IT wasn't for this brat, Prince Ku won't treat you with such an attitude, the relationship between the both of you. And Shui, don't let me hear that bastard name ever again. Lioli, did you and him perhaps? What are you thinking about? Then why did you call him a bastard? What exactly happened? Did he take advantage of you? It's nothing, but Gu Chongda is the young master of the great noble Gu family from the upper realm. His background is far greater than mine. If Brother Chen wishes to deal with him, you better be careful. Don't worry. So what if he is from the great Gu family? There is no one in this realm that can do anything to me. So Prince Gu is the young master of the great Gu family. For a man of such background, when Yi Chen had provoked him in public, there should have been no reason for him to leave Yi Chen alive. Or is it because he seeks to win over me? This dense divine forest has such an abundance of chi. Is this really a created world? I've instructed you guys before to not let what's in front of you deceive you. Did you guys not listen? Use your divine senses to feel it. Within this environment that appears to be flourishing with chi, there's a hint of demonic energy is mixed in. The amount of hidden traps here is amiassurable. This mission is really important to the young master. We must be extra careful and not make a single mistake. It's okay. I have my own way of finding a safe path for us. The trail left behind by the pill is still here. The secret realm was open not too long ago. So, regardless of how fast he is, the furthest he could possibly go would be the areas around the core. Yi Chen, oh Yi Chen, you better work harder as you treasure are my hunting mouse. <laughs>